What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Sears My TV, and I'm coming in here with a quick, quick video. Not gonna hold y'all too long, but Stephen A. Smith reported today on First Take that Kyrie Irving is not too happy in Cleveland. I saw this report as a shot from left field, man. I did not see this coming. Now they are now Stephen A. Smith said that these are just reports and just little rumblings going on. But he has stated that Smith stated that, you know, he has been hearing this for a while now. Now, in Cleveland, you know, it's supposed to be a big three with him, LeBron, and Kevin Love. But to me, it seems that the, the, there's a lack of chemistry. I saw more chemistry with LeBron and Wade and Bosch than, you know, with Kyrie and Kevin. You see what I'm saying? Because last night, they got beat by the Washington Wizards. You know, you had G.R. Smith basically saying that, you know, they didn't play up to par. And that's true. So, I don't understand. I mean, it's kind of, like I said, it's a shot out of left field because I did not see this coming. You know, Kyrie Irving is an all-star caliber player. He is. Yes, he was injured because he was suffering from that, you know, broken left kneecap that he suffered in game one of the NBA Finals last year. And he came back like in late November, early December and everything like that. But to say it's a lack of chemistry and to say that Irving is not happy in Cleveland, eh, but you know, it's just like, it's hard to believe. It's, it's just really hard to believe. But I'm going to read the statement that Stephen A. Smith gave this morning on first take. This is the statement that Smith read on first take, so if I'm looking forward, it's because I'm looking at my computer screen, but here's the statement. Dating back to last year, I've been told that Kyrie Irving ain't too happy being in Cleveland. The situation is not ideal for him. I don't know the particulars. I haven't spoken to him personally. It's something that I've been hearing for months, that under ideal circumstances, he will prefer to be some, someplace other than Cleveland. Now, this season... Irving is averaging 18.9 points per game, 4.3 assists, and 2.8 rebounds. But I don't know how it's going to turn out. You know, will Kyrie Irving leave Cleveland? We'll have to see. Um, do I think he will leave Cleveland? No. I think, you know, all that needs to happen is, like, you know, they, didn't, they, didn't, they just need to get together and just, you know, resume things, I guess you could say. It's just, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, just... Play like they normally play. Play like the team that they, that they was playing, like, you know, um, before, I guess you could say a little bit before David Black got fired. Because before David Black got fired, they were actually playing really good. You feel what I'm saying? But that's just my opinion on the situation. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, leave all your thoughts and comments below. What do you think is going to happen with Kyrie Irving and Cleveland? Let me know how you feel in, in the comments section below. Um, follow me on social media, like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. I have another video coming, like, in a little while. Uh, just basically like a little rant video, you know, my thoughts video, basically on, on my YouTube channel. So, if y'all want to see that, let me know. I'm, well, I'm going to drop it, but just stay tuned, you feel what I'm saying? So, it's your boy Sears Minds TV, and I'm out.